I'll be with the beautiful triangle choke finish. I mean, you never know what he's going to pull out next. Justin Gaethje tapped a long time ago. Rev didn't jump in and he went to sleep. But wow, what a performance by the number one pound for fighter, pound for pound fighter in the world. Habib Nurmagomedov. And Habib Nurmagomedov is immediately resorted to tears. And you can be sure, bottling up a lot of those emotions here during this fight week without his late father, Abdulmanat Nurmagomedov. And now that the mission is accomplished and the task is done, he can exhale and an amazing display from Gaethje coming in. Both of these guys managed by Ali Abdelaziz, who is watching intently somewhere in the world. But just too good, man, too good. I mean, a lot of people felt like Gaethje was a live underdog, the best guy that Habib had faced. But everywhere, just too good everywhere, right? There is no area where this Khabib Nurmagomedov can't fight. There's no area, John. And look at this moment as he finally is able to exhale, right? This fight happens in, in October. You know, his father passed in the summer, and he went right into this. It was a distraction, but now he gets to let it all out. And what a moment for Khabib with Javier Mendez and the rest of his team. This is one of the most exceptional professional athletes and human beings that there is out there. And you just can't imagine all the pressure that he was under and everything that was going through his mind as the tributes for his late father continue to pour in quite a fighter right there. And it's just hard to think about a lightweight solving the puzzle that is Khabib Nurmagomedov. All right, the official decision brought to you by Guaranteed Rate. You could save massive money on your mortgage with the incredibly low rates from Guaranteed Rate. Act now by visiting rate.com. One final time tonight, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Jason Herzog has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 34 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by technical submission due to a triangle choke and still undefeated and the UFC undisputed lightweight champion of the world, Khabib the Eagle Nurmagomedov! <laughs> And now, without question, the number one pound for pound fighter in the world, 29 0, Khabib Nurmagomedov. The world is in awe of your greatness once again. I will give you as much time to gather your emotions, but I see your corner men taking the gloves off. Your thoughts on an epic championship performance tonight. Congratulations. Alhamdulillah. First of all, I want to say Alhamdulillah. God give me everything. Thank you for these guys. These guys with me and with my father more than 20 years. All my team, AK, with Coach Hav, I love him so much. All my team. Oh, thank you. Today, I want to say, this, it was my last fight. And no way I'm going to come here without my father. It was first time when, after what happened with my father, when UFC called me about Justin, I talked with my father, my mother, three days. She don't want to go fight without father, but I promise her it's going to be my last fight. And if I give my word, I have to follow this. It was my last fight here. I know only one thing what I want from UFC Tuesday. You guys have to put me on number one pound for pound fighter in the world because I deserve this. And UFC undisputed, undisputed, undisputed UFC lightweight champion, 13 and all. 13 in UFC, 29 in all my pro MMA career, you know. Oh, I think I deserve it. One more thing. Uh, I want to say thank you, Lorenzo, Fertitta. Thank you, Dana, Hunter, all guys. Thank you so much. And of course, I don't forget about Joe Silva, who signed me here in UFC. Joe Silva, thank you. All this UFC team, everybody around the world, this all pandemic stuff they're doing. Great show, you know. Thank you so much, Justin. Justin. 
2016, I remember when I cut weight, you helped me a lot. Thank you, brother. This is fight without cage. I know you're a great man. I know how you take care of your close people. I know a lot of things about you. Be close with your parents because one day it's going to happen something because you never know what's going to happen tomorrow. You never know. And thank you, guys. Thank you, coach. I love you so much. My teammates, Ali Abdulaziz Rizwan. Oh, alhamdulillah. Today is my last fight here in the UFC. So as you put the gloves down, you do so as the number one pound-for-pound -pound fighter in the world. You go out the way you wanted to as the undisputed UFC lightweight champion. How hard was this week for you overall? It was my father, uh, my father dream. <sighs> what else? Dustin and Connor are gonna fight January. I choke him out, both of them. I'm not interesting for this. I'm not interesting for this. <sighs> Я Вчера мне брат даже говорит, Google сказал, говорит, что ты самый обсуждаемый человек на планете. Я просто не мог в это поверить. Почему? Потому что просто вы сами представляете, да? У меня даже в голове этого всего не было. Я просто хотел вместе с отцом мы шли, просто хотел стать чемпионом. У меня даже в мыслях не было, что вот так все может на мои плечи обрушиться. А, альхамдулилля, если у вас есть родители, будьте рядом с ними, все. У меня один остался родитель, это моя мама. You have left an indelible imprint on this sport, and we congratulate you as you walk away 29-0. There's only one Khabib Nurmagomedov. We wish you a safe trip home, and uh, we look forward to your UFC Hall of Fame induction in a few years. Congratulations. Thank you so much. DC, I love you, brother. Ladies and gentlemen, the undisputed UFC lightweight champion, Khabib Nurmagomedov. But um, Habib retiring breaks my heart. I thought we had at least one more before he would be gone, but you saw him just release all that he was carrying in the octagon after the fight. Well, Habib was very forthcoming with details, specific details about a lot of the things that he went through this week. But the one thing that he held close to the vest, Daniel, was that his mother did not want him to compete without his father mm -hmm. on this planet Earth. And he said he had to close this Gaethje chapter. He did that. And uh, to his words, there's just not anything else for this man to prove. And sadly, I've, I've met guys like Habib before in wrestling, Olympic champions that walk away at the very top of the sport when you know they have so much more to give. And um, if he says it, I'm certain that we won't see Habib again, which is heartbreaking, you know?